Enough with the internet already. You're going to be late for school. Now, who could that be at this hour? Oh, it's Gretchen. She always talks for hours. I can't put up with her right now. Hi, Gretchen. My dear friend, how are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you for asking. A fortune teller? Of course I'll go. Oh, Rachel will be going as well? Well, I'll still go. Oh, no, that's okay. I guess I'll just have to put up with her for the day. <laughs> Yes, you're really something. Listen to me. Let's go to the fortune teller, and then you can come over for a bit. We can catch up. Okay, sounds good. That's perfect. Okay, see you. Poor thing. She's gotten herself hooked on fortune telling, and I don't like Rachel one bit. She's a chatterbox, a big mouth. Gretchen always keeps her near, of course, because she leeches off her. Well, whatever, what do I care? Sarah, I'm speaking to you. I told you a hundred times not to do that at the table. That's all you do now. If you go and get bad grades again, who knows what I'll do to you. Hey, Mom. What? Look at this. What now? Remember the man I told you about a couple days ago? Yeah? My sister's student. He's in the news. Well, now, isn't he a handsome one? Who is that with him? Some model, I guess. Anna didn't pay any attention to him, so she missed out. This is Ken Veral. It's not like he'd wait for her. <sighs> it's crazy. She only has eyes for that boy Kareem, that stupid silly girl. I wonder if this fortune teller puts hexes on people. But why? What if I have them both bewitched to finally break them up? Oh, come on. Would you listen to how silly you're sounding? <sighs> I told you. Rachel isn't doing well. She's gone completely nuts since her poor husband passed away. She talks all the time. She talks and talks nonstop. She went in and she's been there for two hours. Uh, it's my fault for listening to you. Huh? She's out. Go on, Miriam, go in. So then, how did it go? How are you? Oh, my dear. Oh, you're under a very dark cloud. Your life is very, very distressed. Oh, you're telling me. <sighs> my, look at this. What's getting you down? I'm having trouble with my daughters. Oh, yes, I can see that. You have three daughters, am I right? No, just two. The older one is beautiful. Wise and beautiful like her mother. But she doesn't use her wisdom, and she's constantly upsetting you. She causes you pain. You don't even understand. Does she have a boyfriend? She does, and he's a real loser. He is, I can see it in here too. He's no good at all for her. Well, uh, if you hex people as well, could you do something to separate them? My mm. daughter has many suitors after her. And there's this one guy who's so rich. But first we need to separate her from the loser. Don't you even worry, my dear. I can bewitch a glass of water for you and prepare some talismans. But I have to let you know that it's going to cost you. Ah, uh, I imagined. Okay, I'll give you whatever you desire. Just make sure that you separate them. Then consider them separated. <laughs> 